Hey there everyone, this is SoCal playing Anodyne in our tour around the world. And I do mean around as we go. I like actually like just around the surface of the universe. So right, so I mean I think that we should keep doing what we were doing. And I think I want to do this sort of like this in the general order that I visited the place and this is the forest around uh, yeah with like the big temple place hi extra block how are you doing today <laughs> that's cute so we're gonna start by going all around the place and we can see fun little things like extra walls wow that's very exciting Ooh, wait a second is there anything here just walls okay I mean we're gonna keep digging we're gonna keep prying you have a certain amount of let well okay treasure in five three I don't know what that means well like that's Clearly, you know, um, like a space you're dis you're you're designating. Like, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? You know, like the thing. It's a space, a space in space. Uh oh. Well, now I'm here now. Uh, I would love to go back inside that inner room, eh? Hey, and you let me go back in that inner room. That's really nice of you. There's just this huge box of, like, actual things here, and that's wild. 5-3. Like, these are the coordinates. That's the word I was looking for. For a treasure. 5-3. What does that mean? Well, 1-3. 5-1-3, one, two, one, two, probably. Look. Okay, this is the furthest reach. I mean... I feel like we'd be foolish not to fill out this entire grid. 64! Yeah! Everyone loves the 64. Maybe. 44! So... This would be 54? 53. You got me! You certainly did. Nine! Yeah, uh, and maybe they're not as rational, these numbers. But welcome to the Numbers Club. Here's our reset. I don't know. I'm just gonna keep going through this. Here's one one. I'm gonna keep going through this in a spiral pattern. There's no reason not to. And I'm glad that I managed to solve the puzzle of the coordinate bomb, even if th th it was just a gotcha, it was just a prank. I appreciate what you're doing. So this is the big old prank zone, 22, I guess so, unless I figure out something new and exciting to do here, which I mean, could happen. Uh, there are two down below once I can escape this. Uh, okay, wait. Can I go through here? No. Uh, best, easiest way to escape is probably from the top. I'm gonna be real. Well, this is fun. Look at that. It's like stairs. But up there, yeah, up there is the furthest reach. Oh, wait, is this real? Is this real? Or are you just like, can, welcome to Overworld Station. Overworld Station. There's a mass of solidness here. Okay, this is an area I could have seen from the real map. Oh, what? Can I grab this part of a tree? Like, this tree I can grab, no problem. But the larger tree are completely impervious. 
It's interesting. I can still rip off this wall and go to glitch space if I want. And maybe I do want. It is a desire that I cannot quell. Overworld Station, huh? I mean, that's a very strange name. It's very annoying. Well, let's check it out, I guess! Welcome to Overworld Station. There's eyeball and statues in darkness. And I can, in fact, return. This is where on the map? This is part of the dungeon. Alright. And that's kind of the funny thing, is that, yeah, you lock- Oh, Hole. I have to, like, jump? I have to, like, do platforming? Oh, I can- That's me, actually! That person's a completely different art style. There's a lot of me's? We are outside of the map. It is making buzzing sounds. It is dark and staticky. And there is a lot of me. Archives! Archives of what? Uh, nothing here. And I got myself stuck. This. Wait, I might be able to jump. Nope. Ah, I have to come back. I have to come back! Well, since this brings me here, and that's pretty close, I want to take this opportunity to check out, like, the last two, like, lower... ...borbs down here. Like, that's kind of weird, right? See, I've been here before, probably. An explorer is me! No, I've never been here. I got to the edge of here, and this rock is telling me I'm an explorer. And this leads us to this yard and nothing else. Very satisfying secrets to find. Alright, well, an explorer is me. All right. So, yeah, here, it, it's like it's not exactly properly indicated, but it kinda is. But yeah, the lesson here is be careful about digging into places that are too thick, like two layers of block thick. Because I'm probably not gonna be able to come back. All right, so proceed with caution. Wait, didn't you say archive last time? Archives, proceed with caution. Ah. I mean, there might be more up. Doesn't look like it though. Let's split that and PC and twine. Oh, okay. Uh, pit here don't matter. Flip space. Space. Okay. I mean, this area is going to be designed with the thought. Okay, there are two portals. I took one of them. Can I return? I can return effortlessly. Do they bring to different places? They absolutely do. And up is nothing. Okay. So I guess we're going. Hello, alien. Hello, demo. I know you're not actual demo, but looks similar. Do I have a map? I do not have a map. Whoa. Cannot move in this darkened space. Oh, really? Wow. So here, there's just nothing? There's not- like, I cannot go in any direction. Oh! This is 
something. It's very similar. So yeah, going down will probably just get me stuck. I can go to the side, and I can go down. It's going up, it'll get me stuck. I mean, we're making progress. There are, or at the very least, we are going through different spaces. Computer's like, hey, stuff is fun. It's pretty fun. But... Alright. I defaced a little alien. What you got to say about that? Yeah, like, I cannot proceed through there. I mean, I can do this, but all it does is it swaps them. Like, logically... That shouldn't really end up doing much. I can go up, because the darkness there is solid. Well... I mean, it means that if I do go up, I'm gonna get stuck. Oh! So you could go down. Easily. Yeah, there's more of those. Oh, well, this is different. A good time at the home. Sounds great. Okay, this looks to be glitch space below. So, yeah, so we're in like a lower layer, it feels like. Oh. Oh, well, and here's where the prize is. Is that the stone? I think that's the stone. Welcome to black and white. Yeah! The the maker of the game. Given the nature of this game, I think that is the intended answer. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, well, I got the stone. Uh, it's fine. I'm going to assume that's the prize of that extremely unlikable area. <laughs> I did, actually. It doesn't work that way. Ah. So, people have, uh, updated text. Like, there's not a lot of NPCs in the game, but, you know, keep that in mind. Alright, now for the other pathway. It's the beach! Alright, sure doesn't look like much. I don't know how dangerous exploring this is going to be, in terms of getting caught in, like, loops and stuff. But, like, let's just see here. I think this is safe to just, but yes, you know, it's just blue and there is nothing. Okay. So, I mean, okay, I can go here probably. Ooh! <laughs> and we go back into town town. Alright, there's a moss. That's always fun. Check it out. It's my pile map. Pile moss. Alright, so there's this grass here. What you gonna do about that, huh? Uh... Okay, well, I can make my way to the dock, like this. I did it! Dockside! Woo! So I can explore, and there's another island. Uh, of course, there's still no maps here. Alright, I can go here, and there is something. No, I can't. Uh, 
I think I survive if I check here, but there's nothing. this I can get there yes I can all right from here I can go down uh, and end up in staticsville which I don't know if I want I can do this but I'll get caught I get I'll get stuck if uh, uh yeah so now I'm stuck here huh okay I know isn't saying much. Alright. I can survive if I go up. There is an island there. How about on this side? Oh! Hello. Dock. Uh, I need to do this if I want to go there. There's a rock here. There's no way to get there. But there, here, there's an island. Okay, okay, that gets me close enough. And here. Wow. Um, with clearly a link to something. And here's a rock that has a story to tell. West Rift, reality. <laughs> All right. So that's probably those, yeah, those, uh... Okay, and here there is more sequences of docks. Feels like a risk, but hey. We're good. can just do this. Thing up here? Sure isn't. We have found... The limit of this place. Hmm. There's no doing that because there's nothing for me to grab here. Alright, uh, let's check out the property for sale in the hurricane area. Oh my god, you've got to be so I can escape by going straight down from this dock by doing this. Yay! I actually kinda understand the knowledge of this place. The knowledge, the language of this place. Alright, mysterious dark tiles. Okay, so I can do it like that. That's me! So wait, this is my house? I guess. 42 cards now. Ah! <laughs> the less I know about me, the better. Can I interact with, like, any of these? Sofa and boxes. I guess we just moved in. This leads to nothing. I guess I got my prize, is what that is saying. No maps. Whoa, I messed up my workflow. What a rude guy. Feels like I did what there is, like that's a logical end. There was a chest, and um... Ba -ba -da -ba. Oh, yeah, there were two portals, two paths, ending in two t chests. That makes sense to me. Still a lot to find. There'll be five cards left before I can open gate 45, and I didn't find any special prizes here either. Uh, since I kind of want to be thorough, I think I want to just keep, like I, since I dipped into this a little bit, 
Like, I want to do more. I just want to be thorough and finish this place up. Oons, oons, oons. So this is that. This exists in this space. Is there another one of these beside it? Maybe, but you don't get here from here. Um... I think I should just go there from the regular place, but that's fine. Uh, so I know that's there. I'm gonna go there from the other side, but since we're here anyways, no sense in not trying to finish off the temple. So is there anything in this empty room here? There is the void. Who loves the void? Right. Um, well, you know what? While we're checking out the void, is there anything beyond the void? It's immediately glitched zone. Okay. Um. There's also yeah a spot in between the two exits that that might be interesting. I don't know. Things. I mean they are. But they're sprites. They're not tiles. In between the two exits. This one's a convert. Okay, I want to get there from, like, the side. I feel like I should have guessed that. I don't know why I'm saying that, but it's the feeling I got. Hmm. <laughs> inexplicable door portal. What's with this though? Okay, that's a little like place for the lamps. All right, uh, all right, right to entrance. This is great that I have that. Okay, so beside uh, the pathway to the non-lands, and then it'll be, that'll be more than enough for today. It's like if there was an entrance here. Let's just dig our way. One tile higher up. God damn it. Is this high enough? I think it's like level with these rocks is where you want to go. No, I was correct. It's... Uh, trust my instincts, you fool. So, flush underneath the rock, which is what I thought the first time, and I was like, oh no, I'm not gonna trust myself instead. Uh, that was a mistake! I did it! I read the text! That was my reward! Alright, but I think that's what we're going to get. So two cards today, but you know, we explored a lot of areas. Areas that are clearly not meant to be controlled by explored or navigated. <laughs> but we've managed to find a way. This takes a while, but it takes a while because like, you're kind of exploring blindly and any mistakes basically means uh, you know, reloading here from Nexus, and uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So after we did that, last time we went to the beach and then the blood portal, so next time beach. Nice sun and sand and lobsters.